hi everyone welcome back to my channel in this video we will see how to remove leading zeros and spaces from the data informatica use lgrim function if we want to remove leading zeros and spaces from the column you have to write lgrim in the bracket column name comma zero so it will remove all the leading zeros from the column I am mentioning all the syntax of the functions. If you want to remove only leading zeros, then you have to use lgrim column name comma zero. If you want to remove only leading spaces, then you have to use lgrim in the bracket only the column name. Basically, lgrim is a function to remove leading zeros and spaces, and rtrim is a function to remove trailing zeros and spaces. You can use both together also. If we will use both together, lgrim rtrim column name, then it will remove leading and trailing spaces from the column. If we will use lgrim rtrim column name comma zero, then it will remove leading and trailing zeros from the column. If we will mention zero, it will remove zero. If we will not mention anything, it will remove spaces. lgrim remove the leading spaces and zeros, and rtrim remove the trailing spaces and zeros. So based on requirement, you have to use these functions. Now we will see these functions with the help of practical example in a requirement. In this mapping, we are using staff table as a source, details table as a target, and department table as a lookup. So we are loading the data from staff table to details table, and we are using one lookup transformation in which we are using the table called department. You can see we are having three columns in the source ID, name, and department ID. In the targets we are having three columns id name and department name so we want department name instead of department id so here we have used department table as a lookup so if the department id from the source will match with the department id from the lookup then department name we are getting from this lookup and we are populating into the target table so the requirement here is now you can see the department table we are using as a lookup department id starting with 009011 we are using the leading zeros and if you will see the source table department id you can see 119 without having leading zeros so if we are using lookup then it won't match the condition because of the leading zeros here i am going to create one more expression transformation between the lookup table and the target table here i will drag and drop id and name column and what i am going to do is i will open the lookup in the lookup query what i am going to do is i will use ltrim function for the department id because lookup table is having leading zeros in the department id column so i will use ltrim function so that it will remove the leading zeros from the department id and it will match the condition so ltrim department dot department id comma zero so it will remove all the leading zeros having in the department id now it will match the condition i will map the columns and save the changes in the workflow manager i will refresh mapping i will validate the workflow and i will start this session session is succeeded now i will check the target table you can see we are getting the department name from the department lookup table if this video is useful for you then please do like share and subscribe thank you thank you for watching